Jesus Christ, the God whose strength is perfected in our weakness. Today, we're going to dive into a quick Bible study about why we can't let our weakness keep us from serving God. We're going to talk briefly about a man named Bartimus in the Bible. You can see right here, it says, Then they reached Jericho, and as Jesus and his disciples left town, a large crowd followed him. A blind beggar named Bartimus was sitting beside the road. When Bartimus heard that Jesus of Nazareth was nearby, he began to shout, Jesus, son of David, have mercy on me. We're talking about a man with severe issues he can't see, but he knew if he called on the name of the Lord that God could heal him. People were telling this man to shut up. They were yelling at him to shut up. But you know what Jesus said? Jesus said, bring him to me. Bring him to me. The Bible says God's strength is perfected in our weakness. So we got to stop using our weaknesses as an excuse not to follow Christ. And we have to take God at his word. We have to take God at the word of the Bible and just have faith that he is true. After that, Jesus heals that man, restores him. And that's the same God that wants to restore us. It's the same God that wants to heal us. So many times we feel like we're waiting on God to do something in our lives. But God's already done so much. He's waiting on us. People want to act like God's done nothing for them. Well, what have you done for the kingdom of God? Are you reading your Bible? Are you praying? Are you repenting? Are you praising? Are you rebuking the devil in Jesus' mighty name? Are you sharing the gospel? Are you being active in your Christian lifestyle? Are you sinning? I mean, the list goes on and on. We have to live an active lifestyle as Christians, and we got to serve Jesus actively. We're going to finish up today's Bible study with a prayer, but I want to remind you that God is ready to meet you where you are. God loves you. God wants you. So call on the powerful name of Jesus, the name above all other names today, and give God some praise no matter where you're at in your life. Let's pray. Lord Jesus, I thank you for your love of whoever's watching this video, God. I thank you for your love of me, Lord. I pray you would be with us today, Lord, that you would give us wisdom, guidance, discernment, blessings. Lord, I thank you for everything you've done. Forgive us for all of our sins, everything we know we did or we didn't know we did, God. We rebuke the devil in Jesus' mighty name, I pray. We rebuke depression. We push back on that force of darkness. God, I pray we would have deliverance today. Lord, you say your strength is perfected in our weakness, so perfect your strength in us, God. Show us how to follow you better. In Jesus' Jesus' mighty name I pray. Amen. I love you guys so much. Preach is out. But guys, call on the name of the Lord today.